ไม่อยากแล้วเทปพี่รอสงอาดาเนี่ยอุตส่าห์เป็นมาไม่ล่ะเลยติดเทปมาชิชิมชิจามาหมู่อ่ะคู่รู้เอ่อพยายามอะไ
engage in that, how can you be doing misdeeds with your mind? Is it not true? He said, yes, sir. Then you are controlling all these, you are deep vocally, mentally and physically. So you will not be breaking any of these 227 rules and you will be a good monk. So he said, now you know the method, will you follow this? Yes, sir, we will follow this. Then <laughs> you have to follow this all the time. Yes, sir, we will follow all the time. Then he just looked at us, all of us, 40, 45, 50, you are all <coughs> over 50. You have slept every day of your good life. Time. Forty years you have slept, <laughs> fifty years you have slept every night. Now you don't come here to sleep. He said, no. Why do you come to me? To gain merit, sir. And to gain merit you become bhikkhu. Yes, you become bhikkhu. And to become bhikkhu you have to preserve, observe these 227 rules. Yes, sir. And I have told you how to observe these 227 rules by just watching your part, out breath, in breath. Yes, sir. Then you will do that, yes, the whole night, yes. <laughs> That's the first time I was caught right here. This is the this is the method of Buddha, you know. Afterwards I came to know. All this Buddha keep on asking questions and questions until you are caught in the corner. You couldn't get out of it, you see. You couldn't get out of it. So he said, so you go and watch your breath the whole night. That is the first experience of mine hmm? at the age of 52. <laughs> at the age of 52. But uh, <clears throat> you know, by that time I have become a vice chancellor of Mendeley University, you see. I am proud of myself that I keep control of my, I am master of all my empire there, university. Uh, I am above everything. I control my students, my university. So I think I control my mind too. And that night I found that. <laughs> It, it's not I who is controlling me, it's my mind. Yeah? Yeah? The first breath I could keep it here. I concentrated oh, for quite a long time. And then it struck me. What is this? this my loki is feeling very hard. And I looked at it. That is a new, new robe. New robe, stiff. And quite stiff. You could feel it. So <clears throat> off it goes from the nose. <laughs> right. So I pull it back and put it there, and I suddenly felt hungry. Oh, I haven't had anything to eat this evening. <laughs> Excuse me, <laughs> there's a telephone going now. <laughs> Experience of what <laughs> meditation, control of the mind. <laughs> the next thought was that I haven't had anything to eat, and then I went on to, oh, where, where is my family now? Where are they <laughs> staying for the night and what are they doing, thinking all these things? Then I pulled my mind back again. Hmm? It went on the whole night and the they monastery was close by a railway station. Hmm? And at that time the trains were running, running up and down. And I thought the so-called down train would go to Mendeley, you know. And at that time water festival was going. I knew all the people would be enjoying and drawing water festival and I jump, jumped onto the train. <laughs> I jumped onto the train, uh, Milchina train going to Mendeley and went to Mendeley and I just went down following all these crowds, drawing water and singing and dancing. And only after about an hour, I thought, who was <laughs> sitting down here where I was? <laughs> well, my mind was all in Mendeley. <laughs> <laughs> I jump on the train mentally, don't think it physically. I jump on the train and as the train is going to Mendeley, it will go there and all those people will go to the water festival going throughout the whole night. I follow them right along. <laughs> and only after one